Men rank themselves by penile size. This one's tricky because not that I have any experience seeing dicks. There's a probability that if somebody is taller or built larger, they are going to have the appendage that matches. However, that's not just it. It could really be any of them. And who's confirming the size? Is the Jubilee director measuring in? I think they're all capping. I like, they're probably gonna, I'm making assumptions already, but is the Jubilee going in there getting them bricked up? Like, yep, yeah, and then measuring it? Yeah, what we going by? We going by R? Are we going by gummy bear? Like, I don't know what they're trying to, what are they talking about right now? Yeah, is it hard? I guess we'll find out. Like, pause. This dude, we're gonna do a pause already for the beginning, so I don't have to say it. Pause blanket over the whole video. Yeah. I think we all agreed. All right, yeah. 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 Like, you yeah. have that look. Your eyes, your eyes, man. Even if you had the biggest you one, got, you wouldn't you think someone has somebody bigger than you? Like, would you be like, oh, well, clearly I'm not biggest. I'm not sure how this works. Give me a try, give me a try. Number one, sorry, don't get offended. <laughs> <laughs> You come in. You well, you just were and I'm like, oh, I think that's the, the small guy syndrome or whatever. What makes you think, like, yeah, what's your reason? the bottom or... So where do you think you stand amongst the group? Me? Yeah, where do you think you stand? I can't put myself there. Well, so where do you think you stand? <laughs> Humble not, Jesse. I think he should just stay there. I'm fine with him staying there. I'm going to be down. there. Honestly, I'm going to be on the top of the hill. I think the two of you should switch at the very least, though. So I have a question for you. Who do you think would be Peck, because this we got a ring. The two that we have is the smallest, I would say. Is that a gay thing to answer? It helps as a gay guy, because he would have a better idea. Yeah, I feel like a gay man might know. Assuming that he's either seen or been around or hooked up with enough, if that's his preference of yeah. different races. Well, with that question, you kind of have to envision those guys right in front of you and try to envision what their thing would look like. Pretty much is what it's best to be like, what you think, bro? Yeah. <laughs> it's like, oh, I don't know, what do you think? I'd be listening to the gay guy, like, man, r run this, please. The guy with the blue jacket, yeah. Okay. Hey, why'd you guess him? Wait, what? Why'd you guess him as the gay guy? Because I just figured that's who you thought that was. Yeah, he's undeniably gay. Here, I'll take one for the team and go to this no, side so that no one has to. Can I switch with you? I mean, yeah. whatever you think. Okay, okay. <laughs> I think that's good. It, do you have any input on this? I think I think I belong maybe in the middle, to be honest. But like off of what? See, everyone has their own little skill on their head. Yeah. All right, I think we're locked in. Good. Locked in? Sure. Looks good. Okay. Now, what's y'all's final guess? I can only do smallest and biggest, but that doesn't even sound right. Smallest, I'm thinking, is this guy in the golden? Okay, I'm getting smallest for that. And then, actually, I'm wrong. I think gay guy in the blue is smallest. And then the golden jacket, I think smallest. I'm, I guess you would look at him, he looks awkward and he's small, but you could just have it. Like, I don't know. I feel like these two tall brothers and the Armenian brother on the end could be having the largest appendages. Yeah. I'm gonna go with biggest guy. Green jacket? Yeah, I'm gonna go with him. Or like the Asian guy, I feel like would surprise you because you'd think he'd have a small one. But he's just like, but it's just like, but he's tall, he's very tall. being bowed, like right there. Bow. <laughs> um, so then to the question of does, like, does size matter? Well, as a gay man, I always say that I'm not a size queen. I'm a penile proportion queen. You can have a small, but really pretty dick. And a big dick is, can just be like a massive, gargantuan honking thing, right? There's beauty in all penises. So he just said that he got a small. <laughs> well, actually that makes me think of something interesting. We have like the three shortest guys as the I three biggest too, yeah. There's like a stereotype in the gay community that like small skinny guys always have like a honking third sure. thing because like they don't go to the gym. So all their energy and food goes to that instead. And that could be a valid thing that I don't really know about. I have the same size penis since I'm fourth grade. What? Well, what? what? Where are you gonna put me now? What if he has a micro penis? He said he's had the same since fourth grade. How do you remember that? No, I don't want to be thinking about a fourth. I know, but like, <laughs> no, but think about yourself, I guess. Yeah. But I don't even think I can remember that. Why would he even say that? Come on, bro. That guy been acting weird the whole yeah. time. Can you speak about the pressure to be bigger? Uh, personally, I've never faced nah, that. I'm, nah, I'm not. I don't feel that. No, I don't. Yeah, I don't feel that. I think there's a lot of a lot of pressure to impress, and you know. Even a personal pressure and a confidence boost. True. You know. Growing up. That was the biggest. Yeah. Has anyone done any sex work? I actively do porn, yeah. <laughs> 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 All right, because of that, I'm going to go into third, and I feel like you should be in second. Oh, wow. So no lying. Oh, that's the examiner right there. Okay. okay. That's the moment okay. of truth, my friend. Yeah. Oh. Now, now is that just a gag for the video? Are they really doing no, that? No, they, they gotta really be doing it at this point. You think so? Yeah. You think they're back there? Yeah, I think they're back there showing them. Okay, okay sorry. A couple seconds. You all right. This is a ju <laughs> Jubilee thing that I'm not gonna volunteer for.
You have to like wait to get it hard. Yeah, how do you measure the hard one? He said awesome. Oh, wow. <laughs> hard length? All right, now how are we getting it? Whoa, 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 who's back there? Okay, I can't. So you're telling me the medical examiner just waited patiently in there or helped him out or something? I don't think I could stay erect with another grown man. Right there. With an approach with a roller. Ready to run my shit. you ready? Just a minute. <laughs> Almost ready? Just a minute. We're going to start with the ranking for the soft length sizes. Seventh. Andy. I knew it was right. Sixth. Sixth. Asher. Oh. Fifth. Baron. Fourth. Giovanni. Okay. Ooh. All right. Come on. It's you. <laughs> Third. Tanner. We knew this was coming. No. Wait. Second. Wait second. David. Yes. First. You really shot yes. there. Starting with Andy, can you share your soft length size? Uh. 2.5. Oh! Why did they make them share it? I would have lied. I would have read this. Man, I'm lying on this thing, man. 0.5. Four. Also four. Uh, 4.5. 4.5. All right. We're going to move on to what we've all been waiting for. The hard length sizes. In seventh, Andy. Ah. In sixth, Baron. Oh. All right. I told you. Damn. In fifth. <laughs> David. I told you. Oh, wait, David went down. Oh! In fourth, Asher. What? NBC. <laughs> In third, Giovanni. Mm -hmm. In second, Tanner. Damn, Tanner got up there. First, first Jesse. But we knew this. Yeah. It's all different from the beginning. We've seen this coming. We <laughs> Andy, can you start with your hard length size? Oh, man. 4.8. We are going to hand you a cucumber that is cut to your size. And here is a visual demonstration of what <laughs> you're working with. Six. That's okay. for me. <laughs> um, and then six. Cheers. <laughs> 6.3. Nice and big. 6.5. Wow. Damn. Stop thinking about it. Seven. God. I wouldn't have thought that he was packing a seven eight, piece. Eight. Damn. Okay, guys, that point. Wow. Like, oh, baby. <laughs> okay. Right. How does everyone feel now? I feel all right. I'm still I'm happy. Confident. Yeah. I'm good. Yeah. Mm. They got to show that it's below average, dude. Do you guys feel like talking about size so openly has maybe relieved some pressure or taboo surrounding the subject? Yeah, because it's yeah. dumb. It's like just talking about it, it's like clearly no one actually cares. Like, I mean, and if there is any kind of actual care, like it's, it's like we all know it doesn't matter. And, and, and I will say, just the stupid stigma about, oh, you gotta have big dick, whoop you whoop. As long as you know what you're doing, I think you're straight. You know what I mean? So that motion in the ocean, like this. yeah. Them all standing there with the cucumbers, yeah, whatever, whatever size you, you don't care. But we all got dicks. Genuinely curious how they got them to get the hard measure. The whole thing could have been capping. Like no, that could have been a fake scene. They could have. Everyone could have just said. And all going into the same room. They the guy just nutted right before, and then you go in and still like steamy in there. Oh man, guy just watching you, waiting for for the right moment to measure. Now did you say nutted? Just because he was hard didn't mean he had to. Yeah, no, you're right, you're right. <laughs> when you're hard. Hard, stuff be coming out sometimes. Yeah. So it's like true. So you're doing that act to some, like you know. Then imagine the guy measured. No, don't don't do that. Yeah. You're just in there to measure dick size. And you end up getting blasted on. It's like, what if you don't last that long? It's like, can't even don't have time to measure. No, no, measure now. No, go go go. go, go, go. Uh, Wait, measure now. Wait, that's the best time to measure. I might even go do the demonstration of what that might look like. I do believe, man. They keep on stepping up these concepts. That's funny though. Shout out to all the dicks.